Brent Tech here, where Tech is made simple. Just a video to show you how you can disable a feature called Superfetch on Windows 10 and Windows 11. Now just to give you a brief background as to what Superfetch is and what it actually does in case you were unaware. Superfetch is a service called SysMain that um, is enabled by default and runs automatically in the background on both Windows 10 and Windows 11 as a background service. And what it does at the end of the day is it basically over time determines what apps you're most likely to use. And then over time it pre starts preloading those apps into your PC's um, memory and RAM so that you can open and launch those apps a lot quicker and a lot faster. So in other words, the name Superfetch um, it's a service that super fetches and speeds up the launching of your most frequently used apps on your PC and your device because apps that run from memory, your RAM, will work a lot faster as an example than run from a hard drive. Now, Superfetch is enabled by default and is a default feature in the operating systems. But over time, it has been known in certain, in certain circumstances to start causing um, PCs to run a lot slower and a little bit more sluggish. So if you have suddenly, for no um, given reason, started noticing that your PC is running a lot slower and seems to be running a little bit sluggish over a certain period of time, then you can try disabling Superfetch, the sysmain uh, service, and see if that helps. Now, I must just say at the outset that it's not guaranteed that disabling Superfetch in Windows 10 and Windows 11 will speed up your device, but it is something you can try and has been known in certain circumstances to, um, once it has been disabled, to speed up your device and just, feel, and just make it feel a whole lot snappier and quicker at the end of the day when launching and running your apps. Now, um, we have to disable a service. So to do that, we would just head to our search and enter services and click on that, and that will open the legacy services menu. Now, this is a list of all these services that are available in the operating systems. And um, as you can see, some are running and some aren't. And that's a video for another day. Now, um, to disable the service, we need to head down to the S's. So, HRJKLMN, OPQRS. And we're looking for SysMain. And here we go, SysMain. And if I hover over that service, the description reads, maintains and improves system performance over time, as mentioned. And then what we need to do is double click on that entry. And now you'll see service status is running. So we have to click on stop and that will take a moment or two just to stop that service. And there we go. It's actually stopped it. And now you will see startup type. As mentioned, it runs automatically in the background. And we have to then choose the disabled option. Click on apply. OK, and now that service has been disabled, as you can see, sysmain disabled. So now that is not running anymore in the background and has been completely disabled. And as mentioned, could help um, if you have known and noticed your PC um, starting to become a lot slower and sluggish over time. This could help once again speed up your device, although not guaranteed. And then um, if you want to revert the process and then enable Superfetch once again, you just come back to your services menu, look for sysmain. Double click on the entry um, just click on automatic because it is an automatic default service. Click on apply and then yeah, you'll see service status stopped. Just click on start. Give it a moment. And there we go. Everything's up and running how it was prior to disabling this service. So that's just a quick and easy way to disable Superfetch and then re-enable it just to try that out to see if that will and speed up your device if you have noticed your device becoming a little bit sluggish. So thanks for watching, and I will see you in the next one.